All right, keep it going. Welcome your next comment to the stage. Give it up for Jackson. Hi. It's my senior year in high school, and that, thank you. That means I get to move out pretty soon to the basement. No, yeah, it's really cool being in your senior year of high school. It's great being, you know, at the top of the food chain. That's pretty cool. But, you know, below the scary juniors who vape in the bathroom. But certain, you, uh, certain universities uh, I've been looking into require volunteer hours. So I've been volunteering at this little art school near my place. It's like this preschool art class. So cute. And I've realized during that class, it's really easy to talk to kids because all you have to do is just repeat what they say back to you. It'll be like, what are you drawing? A dragon. A dragon? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's cool, right? It is cool. It can breathe fire. It can breathe fire. <laughs> forever, like 20 minutes of that. <laughs> but you have to be careful, because if you do, if I do it to like one of my teachers, I'd be like, where's your homework? Where's your homework? <laughs> excuse me, excuse me, principal's office, principal. Oh. <laughs> Horrible. It's not a fun time. Um, cr I think the weirdest thing in the world is probably Crayola colors. There's a bunch of different ones out there. There's Robin Egg Blue. De uh, Robin Egg Blue, Purple Mountain's Majesty, which is a real thing, and Space Black. But I've come up with some of my own, like, Depression Blue, <laughs> Blood of Your Enemies Red, <laughs> Cafeteria Slot Beige, <laughs> and Grandma's Ashes Gray. <laughs> Hi, Grandma. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know if you've been um, keeping up with the most important news lately, but Shakira has been committing tax fraud. <laughs> yeah. So I guess her hips do lie. <laughs> Something else that happened recently was Movember. That was pretty cool. Because of puberty, I was a certified candidate. So that's pretty great. <laughs> I think uh, the only thing worse you can find in the ocean that isn't a killer shark would be a serial killer shark. Because <laughs> they've been around the coral reef. <laughs> I don't have style. I don't. I grab what's on the floor, and I'm just like, all right, cool. That's my outfit for the day. It could be dirty, whatever. I put it on. But the only time I know I'm dressed really well is when my mom says I look like a homeless person. <laughs> because I've set the bar so low <laughs> that dressing like a homeless person is really, really good. <laughs> uh, does anyone here take Duolingo lessons at all? <laughs> really? OK. <laughs> um, no, yeah, I, uh, I'm Greek, so I've been doing some Greek lessons on Duolingo. And I, I'm not really motivated to do my lessons at all. But when they do motivate you, they use like kind of a guilt trip tactic. So they're like, yeah. So they're like, we miss you at Duolingo. We're really sad. Please come back. Please. Duolingo is a single struggling father with 10 kids, but sure, you're too busy to do your lessons. <laughs> Are there killer, clown, uh, killer clownfish in the ocean? And if so, do they team up with the serial killer sharks? <laughs> Be careful while you're swimming. Have any of you had a puppuccino from Starbucks? If you haven't, don't get it, doesn't taste like a dog. <laughs> Not at all. Christmas is coming up, that's exciting for me. Uh, 
Yeah, no, it's great. Hope you didn't get that awkward gift, like the sock gift or the fuzzy sweater gift. I like fuzzy sweaters, but I think they should have a warning in the corner. You know, they can have that cute cat on the front, but I think in the warning, you know, it should say, uh, warning may cause itchiness, discomfort, chafing, <laughs> public embarrassment, <laughs> chafing again and the urge of your mother to post a picture of you on Facebook. <laughs> I don't think old people should drive. 85 and up, you're out of here, dude. Sorry. <laughs> uh, the Why I think this is because um, I was getting a ride back home from my job, and my grandpa's driving me. And you know, he's old and Greek, so he's like, every day you learn something. He's telling me something. I don't know what it is. But I'm looking, out, I'm, look, I'm looking out the window. I look down. And I realize we're in the bike lane. That's, that's not a good thing. So I turn and tell him, I'm like, uh, hey, we're in the bike lane. And he goes like this. He's like, there's no bikes. I don't like eyelashes. <laughs> Putting it out there. <laughs> the one thing that eyelashes do is that they keep dirt and dust out of your eyes. If that is the case, then why am I still getting dirt and dust in my eyes? And if they can't even mess their job up even more, they're getting stuck in my eye. <laughs> They can't even do their job right the first time. Now they pull that. It's horrible. Anyway, that's my time. Thank you. Give it up for Jackson Apopolis.